Alright, so here's a DIY vulture droid slash hyena bomber or any type of droid or Star Wars character mobile. So um, I got the the first four up there. They're all vulture droids, but this is a hyena bomber. So um, this is a a mobile, and if you have a ceiling fan in the room, you have to turn it off. Wait for it to stop spinning. And then what you'll need is a ladder to get up to the ceiling, some duct tape, and some string here, which I already cut a piece out of this string roll I borrowed from the garage. And also you'll need some scissors, a printer, and a computer. And you'll need to find images of Star Wars characters like this hyena bomber, print them out in color or in black and white and what you do is you take your scissors you cut the string and since you have your string you will take your duct tape I'm holding the camera with one hand you'll go out to the desired small length for the vulture droid for prop you will cut it, take it out of your scissors by opening it, and if, right now, since I'm holding the camera, an optional thing is, so sorry, it's just about to fly away, take your string, which I think I've lost again, which happened to me, oh here it is, found it, take your string, attach it to the duct tape, Press down on it. You will take it off. Flip your character over. Attach the duct tape to the to the back of the character, like I'm doing right now. You will lift it up, put it upside up, and cut another piece of duct tape. It has to be um, a very small portion, but depending on how big the print is, you will also if your printer can adjust size, you will have to make it small. Like this, this is perfect size. What you'll do is attach to the character, like here, and you'll go up the ladder. I think this piece was too small, so I'll cut another one. So you'll go up the ladder and tape it to the ceiling. Right, that's a fairly sized piece. Stick it to the scissors. So, um, take your character. Attach the string to the tape. Go up and take the scissors off the platform you are working on. If the... Um, if you're using a bed to get up to the roof and with the air of the fan or any fan or something that moves air in here they're gonna spin around so what to do is just tape it to the ceiling and when I turn on the fan I forgot to turn it off from the main control so when your fan starts up or you turn on something at night that moves air like let's say a heater when the air conditioner comes on, like those props up there, they will spin with the movement. Now be careful not just to have the fan on a strong setting so that it looks like they're flying like crazy. Just keep it on a lower medium speed if you put them close to the fan. So you see that they're starting to move? He's a walking vulture droid. He's a flying vulture droid. There's another vulture droid, the cute, the cute one that startled the hyena bomber. Let's wait for this one to turn back. 
There it is. It's moving. A vulture droid that is flying. Another one. So, that's it. That's the vulture droids. Goodbye. And I hope you enjoyed this DIY.